Hey guys, ITG Flash here. Welcome back to the channel, and we've got something to talk about. For those of you that have no idea, I've been playing dance games since 2004, okay? And like any other dance game player, we experiment with different shoes. We find some we really like, but somewhere along the path, the select few stumble upon what is the dance game shoe for them, the shoe that they love. And for me personally, those shoes since 2007 have been my Puma Tapers, okay? These have held the crown as my primary dance shoe quite literally for 12 years. And I may have found the shoe that could dethrone them. You guys want to find out what they are and why? Well, if you're ready, let's go. All right, so why have Puma Tapers been my primary shoe since 2007? First off, they are very minimalistic, they're very light, but the reason why these were my favorite shoe for so long, the bottom, the sole. This is almost like a rounded circle on the bottom of the sole, makes hitting the down arrow so much easier. Back in the day before pad modding was, was so well known, and nowadays people make arrows completely level with the metal or even above that. Um, so back in the day when the arrows were actually below the metal, this was actually great to have this sloped hump on your heel. It made hitting the down arrow so much easier where you didn't have to step back that far. These raised sides right here, these circular nubs, made hitting the side arrows very easy. So you only had to hit the side arrow with pretty much this amount of your shoe. And then these right here, these are raised on the toe. These made hitting the up arrow so incredibly easy. Um, so that's why Puma Tapers have been my main driver, my main dance game shoe for so long. So naturally, the next question is, Flash, what shoe are you talking about that could possibly dethrone the shoes that you have worn for dance games for 12 years on and off? But they're my primary dance game shoe that have stayed tried and true. I've gone through different iterations of shoes. I bought probably well in excess of 30 different types of shoes, trying to test them out and see if we could find a pair to dethrone. But up until this point, I just have not found a shoe that even had the potential of dethroning a Puma Taper until now. So these shoes, these shoes right here, the company name is Zero Shoes. And this company's slogan is Live Life Feet First. Great slogan. The story around how this guy started his business is actually pretty poetic. He loved running, but he was getting injuries. He was getting sore. And his doctor actually told him to start running barefoot. And he said it actually worked and he wanted to do that. Obviously, you need some protection on your feet. So he started developing minimalistic type shoes, which uh, ultimately that's where we are now. They've got some different models. For those of you that are maybe just stumbling across the channel or watching this for the first time, don't know who I am. Uh, my name is ITG Flash. I've always gone by the nickname Flash since way back in high school. Pretty much everybody calls me this, coworkers, my family, friends, pretty much everybody. And the fact that I stumbled across these shoes and actually love them, it, it, it's almost poetic that this shoe could be the shoe to dethrone my Puma Tapers. The, the name of this shoe is actually Speed Force. Right? Zero Shoes Speed Force. The Speed Force has the potential of dethroning my Puma Tapers that I have used almost exclusively on dance games for 12 years now. It's almost poetic. For those of you that are absolutely clueless about Flash, Flash taps into the Speed Force to run fast. It's only natural that I tap into the Speed Force to improve my dance game skills. I'm actually in love with them. They're so minimalistic. So for the specifics of why I love these shoes, the fact of how thin the sole is and how flexible it is, it allows me, it, it basically allows the bottom of the shoe to contour. It allows you to feel exactly where you are on the pad. There's a nice tapping sound that comes from when you hit the arrow. Me personally, when I'm playing dance games, I love to hear myself. That is actually one of the ways how I have such good timing, but I do play primarily off of sound and hearing my feet hit the pad. I personally can adjust when I'm getting off sync to hearing myself on the pad rather than reacting to something on the screen. I feel like I can react faster by listening to my feet. And the fact that these contour so much and they're just so incredibly flexible, yet they have this nice sturdy feeling to them. Probably the only thing I could suggest to make these even better would be a red color, which they unfortunately don't have right now. Zero Shoes, if you're watching this, red, please, would appreciate it. And one of the interesting things to me about this shoe and why I'm actually shocked that I like it is typically when there's a tread, in my history of playing dance games and going through 40 plus different versions of shoes and stuff like that, 
Usually when there's raised tread on the bottom, it makes it harder to time. However, the fact that it's so uniform on the bottom, you don't really feel the tread. They don't get caught on the brackets. It's an amazing shoe. And the fact that it is called Speed Force and is going to probably dethrone my Puma tapers that I've been using over 12 years is just, it, it, it's simply poetic. The only thing better that could happen is a, a red version and maybe down the line a lightning bolt on it. I don't know. Maybe I'll mod them. We'll go ahead and jump into some gameplay right now and you guys hear what they sound like. You can see how they look and all that stuff. Let's go ahead, jump into some gameplay and we'll go for a sound test right now. yeah that is why i am crazy about these shoes that's pretty much it um if you guys liked this type of video smash the like button definitely get subscribed to the channel if you guys want me to go over some thought processes and what goes into picking a good dance game shoe definitely let me know down in the comments we'll definitely do a video if we have enough interest also if you guys want to see me wearing these live go check out my twitch it's itg flash i'll put an animation right here there will be a link down in the description thank you for watching this video i truly appreciate it but that's gonna do it for me guys i'm itg flash i appreciate you guys watching definitely get subscribed to the channel for more crispy content like this and we'll be seeing you in the next video take it easy guys